Hi, you fabulous freaks. Today we're gonna do the uh, five second game where we play five sec. I don't remember the title. You play, you play like five seconds of a song from somebody's playlist. Is it the five second challenge, maybe. Yeah, five second challenge. Okay. And they have to guess what the song is, and we're gonna trade off with Poe a little bit later, and then switch around and do all that jazz. So. You guys are about to find out how terrible I am at naming goth music. I'm terrible at, um, I'm just terrible at naming off, uh, freaking, uh... Band names? Yeah. <laughs> that. <laughs> I recognize band names, but I never re recognize the songs. And yeah. That is, that is, like, honestly my real plight. Yeah, I think we're gonna count it as a win if you can guess the band, in all honesty. If it's a bonus point if you can guess the song. Like, because we're, we're old, we're all, I'm almost 30, you and Poe are in your 30s, like... Thank you for being honest that we're time. We're all old. This is an ad. Guess the ad. Hmm. It was Google. <laughs> well, that is Sisters of Mercy. Correct. Can you guess the song? Is that, uh... More? Yes. Okay. Good job. I want more! Everybody knows Sisters of Mercy, though. Mm. That went to eight seconds, but... I have no idea. Not from that opening. Um, that Did it feel stupid? That <laughs> was... Uh, Voices of Masada. Okay, I don't know that band. You don't know that band? Okay. No. Uh, this is uh, House of Usher, and this is Death and His Daughters. Yep, got it right. I have, I, I can't, I can't go off of the beginning of songs. I... That's the point! <laughs> Yeah, I, I know, but <laughs> I can't go off of intros. That is uh, Joy Division. Okay. Disorder. Wow. Uh, that is Reptile by the Church. Yes. Got that right. That doesn't sound good. <laughs> what is that? Echo and the Bunny Men. Oh, it's post punk, okay. <laughs> We're sneaking in things from all different genres in there. Uh -oh. Okay. I'm gonna be mad if you don't get this one. I'm gonna let it go for a little bit until actual instruments start playing. Dun -dun, dun -dun, dun -dun. You you know what this is. Uh, this is A Forest by The Cure? Yes. Okay. Come on, you know this one. It's from one of your favorite movies. Is this Burn? Can you, uh, oh wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, no, no, oh god. I can play Burn. It. Oh god, I'm stupid. Uh, that is, um... I can play it over again. That is, uh, Little Sister. Cry Little Sister. Yes! Again, gonna wait until actual music starts playing. Oh, this is, um, this is Lebanon Hanover. Um, oh god, is this Gallo Dance? Gallo's Dance? <laughs> As soon as I hear Kesha, I fucking know. You managed to get it from the fucking song that was playing for a slight second in the goddamn music video. It's distinct. <laughs> it's distinct. Esoteric. Um, I don't know what song, though. Give up. 
Yeah, I gave up on the song. All right, it's a uh, city of ashes. Okay, but I was right on the band, right? <laughs> I was right on the band, though, right? Yes. Okay, go ahead. Oh, children, oceanside. That's our song. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give you a little more than just that. Yeah. Was that King Dude or was that the Shroud? That was the Shroud. Okay. Okay. That is one song I'm not very familiar with of theirs. It literally just said the title. Did it? Mm-hmm. Oh, this is like, oh damn, that's, that's going to be an easy one. <laughs> oh. I didn't... It's Spiral I didn't... Back because she just kind of whispers it. Oh, okay. She was too quiet. <laughs> Damn ethereal wave. Uh, she wants revenge. Um, out of control. Yep. Yeah, I was just listening to that the other day. With our high heels against the wall. I cannot tell from that. Oy, oy, oy. I, don't I don't know if that's picking that up or not. Okay, that if that plays anymore, we'll probably get flagged. <laughs> what is it? It's Dead Magic by Dead Skeletons. Oh, okay. Or I've only Dead Magic One, technically. I've only recently gotten into them, so yeah. Okay. You guys probably won't know this one. Gary Robert in Community. Yep. Isolation. If you don't know them, you should check them out. They're good. They're great. Post punk band. They're local. No good. All right. Okay. That wasn't King Dude again, was it? No. No. Definitely not. It's also a sort of local band. Sort of local? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, scary Bar? No. No? Sort I believe it's the right local. state, though. Sort of local? Mm-hmm. Give up? Yeah. Kentucky Vampires. Oh, duh. Spider and the Fly. That's Scary Black. That I, is. I don't know what song that is, though. That is Josephine. Okay. It is now a pose turn. Shit. Oh, uh, Sisters of Mercy? Yeah. Fuck yeah. Can you guess the song? Um, Black Planet? Yeah. Holy fuck, how did I know that? <laughs> I know that one. Like the voice sounds familiar though. That is Lebanon Hangover. Or Hangover. I keep saying Hangover. Hanover? Le yeah. Lebanon Hanover. No, oh, I haven't I haven't gotten a chance to really listen to those guys too much. Babes of the 80s. Huh. Haven't really listened to them too much. I need to look into them. They're actually pretty good. Alright. This is a dark wave playlist. Nice. <laughs> Oh, that sounds familiar. Uh, shit. It's dark wave, right? Yes. Uh, why does that sound so familiar? Uh, why can't I come up with it? Son of a bitch. Oh, I'll give you a guess. It's a, definitely a newer, newer goth band. 
Right? Is it like Kentucky Vampires or something? No. No. Angels, no, it's not Angels of Liberty. I can't fucking think of it. We actually talked about them not too long ago. Uh, Dara Majesty. <gasps> Fuck, yeah, you're right. All right. I haven't listened to I, I keep going back to my, my spooky list. I'm sorry. All right. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's do this one. Just give it a little longer. That one's new. But I like it. That is Boy Harsher. Hmm. I like it. Yeah. That one always makes me think of my hubby. Oh. Uh, London After Midnight? No. Fuck. This is Voices of Masada. Oh, okay. Scarecrow Joe couldn't get it either, so don't That's feel bad. I've never heard of them either. That's so. kind of a newer one to me, but yeah. I like the, the intros of it, so. I'm gonna have to look into some of these bands more. Sounds like a dramatic scene. File not found. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> it's like it sounds like the ah. Oh, it sounds familiar, but I can't label it. That is. Do you give up? Yes. The neon judgment Chinese black. Well, that's why. <laughs> that would explain it. That sounds like something I'd probably randomly listen to in the background. This one. Oh. That sounds reminiscent of Birthday Massacre a little bit. Somewhat makes me think of them. Is that Birthday Massacre? No, it's oh, not. Oh, okay, I didn't think so. <laughs> you said it's mostly... No, wait, that was the other playlist. Uh... Shit. <laughs> Susie? No. No. Fuck. It's funny you're not getting this one, though. Why, is it Bauhaus or something? No. God damn it. <laughs> it is... Sisters of Mercy. Son of a bitch! Temple of Love. Oh! I, better, I don't listen to that one that much. So I know that guy's voice. Uh. Shit. Is that Joy Division? No. No. Why do I know that guy's voice? <laughs> I know why. I've probably heard it before. I just can't think of it. <laughs> Alright, fine. You win. It is the cult. Summer Son of a bitch! That's why I knew the noise. <laughs> Son of a bitch! And actually, we already did that one. This one you should know. I should. It's a very familiar song. I think a lot of us have even heard it, like, back as kids, just because it's such an old song and a popular one. I should know it. God damn it. Ugh. Brain. Too bad you can't replay it. <laughs> I can. It's oh, a really? YouTube video, yeah. Oh. That sounds like the intro to a lot of different songs. Like, I wish I could hear the person's voice, but I don't know. Yeah, I'll keep playing it. Oh! Uh, um. Joy? No. No. It sounds so fucking familiar. <laughs> uh, Bow? No. No. Nope. Not Bow House, not Joy Division. Nope. No, it's not Sisters, because the voice isn't right. Uh, but it is an older one, right? Yes, it's an older one. 
God damn it, who am I thinking of? <laughs> In all honesty, I thought this was a Pink Floyd song for the longest time. Really? Yes. It's not, though. Who am I thinking of? Uh. Just because it's got that feeling to it. Right? Uh, shit. I can't fucking think of it. I should know it, but I can't think of it. You give up? File not found, I'm sorry. <laughs> that is the church. Cry, <laughs> okay, okay. So. <laughs> it's like I don't even need like the full thing, and I'm like, oh fuck, yeah, I know that one. <laughs> okay, but for bonus point, can you guess who that's actually by? Oh shit, who was that originally by? Because I couldn't, I didn't even know. I had to look at it. Right? So. I just know the name of the song for the most part. Yeah. Like, I just know the name of the song and the lyrics, and I keep forgetting who the fuck it's actually by. <laughs> so no, I don't remember who it's by. It is by Gerard McMahon. Oh, okay. I think, yeah. I think that's it. I added it. myself, I'm sorry. <laughs> Apparently I'm a poser, because I only listen to a handful of bands. Yeah. I mean... But I'm getting there. Yeah. I think within the past two years, I've been more exposed to it. Right. So. Because, like, of... I know you and I, where we came from, we came from, like, Mansonville, basically. Yeah. That's all... Mansonville and those cornfields listening right. to corn. Corn and Manson and all that shit. That's what we grew up with. Yeah. And then we learned, oh, goth exists. Yeah. So this is what real goth music is. This is cool. Yeah. When Scarecrow Joe and I did it earlier, I actually told him to bring up the uh, the metal playlist to see if I could guess some of those because yeah. I was curious. Because I hadn't been listening to it in a while. Right. So, and I managed to get some, but some of the heavier metal bands I couldn't for the life of me. Right. Also, I think some of it is just putting people on the spot. And so it's like, ha! Huh? <laughs> Name five of Robert Smith's albums. Now! Fuck. <laughs> I don't fucking know. I don't I, care. I've never met a person who does that, like, ever. Right. Like, I don't, I don't... And if they do, that's just rude. That That's shitty and stupid. That's kind of like those guys who are like, Oh, you're a nerd? We'll name, like... 15 of the Spider-Man comics, still so all love. I'm like, fuck you. That's when you look them straight in the eyes and you tell them that you actually fucking hate that thing and you walk away without breaking eye contact at all. It's just fun to explore. Yeah. It's fun to explore music and it's fun to do stuff like this because who knows, maybe down the road we'll redo it and see just how well we've gotten yeah. into it. But, uh, oh, what was it? I was reading something the other day that said after a certain age, like around 35 or something, we mm -hmm. stop wanting to listen to new shit. Yeah. And I'm just like, I call bullshit. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I call bullshit because I'm in my early 30s and I'm like wanting to hear all the new shit. That's more of what in my 20s was more like because in my 20s I was just like, I'm only interested in this thing. Right. And now I've like expanded and like, I'm like, okay, I'm more into this. And yeah, learning, like... Hearing new music is awesome. Mm -hmm. I mean, I have to, it, it does get a little frustrating whenever you're like, man, that sounds really catchy and I want to sing along because I'm one of those people. I'm one of those assholes. I'm a sing along asshole. Free your mind. Exactly. And the rest will follow. Exactly. I'm a sing along asshole. That's, that's just how it is. So it's, <laughs> so, you know, I go take a shower and I'm just like, mm, yeah, I'm just, <laughs> you know, singing to the shower. Yeah. Uh, All right. Yeah. Well, See you so, guys later. <laughs>